together was here that was back when we were in love and everything was good we were so happy back then but I think we are gonna show you a house tour but first let us let you in on our plans for today there is a lot of really ugly uh, architecture but uh, Calabria also is a place where you find truly charming mini towns you know one of those on top of a mountain, there's a few ones we uh, want to show you and the first one is Barolato. You can stand here with a beer and enjoy the ocean view and the prospect of bratwurst or steak. This is the area where I fuck you up playing Yahtzee. It's only 11-4 <laughs> in your favor. Three bedrooms, two bathrooms. Upstairs is where we sleep and where we shower and where we make love. Welcome to the shagging wagon. Just tumble out here in the morning. Sun rises right there. Amazing. This is a, a closet, apparently, but there is a room in here. Check it out when you stand here, and then you just glance at the beautiful view. So idyllic. I'll say this is what you want for a view, right? Exactly, and you can also enjoy it from down here in the backyard, which is my favorite place. Come on. Whoops. Uh, yeah, that was the house tour. Epic uh, MTV Crips. Let's go. Say hi to Buggy Bob. Yeah. In case you're wondering, this is Bobby. Buggy Bobby. Because it's plus 500 years old, it's very charming as you could see. So we're just gonna go for a walk and relive some of our romantic moments. Uh, one of the first right here. Not only were we falling in love, we were also falling in love with this view. I just saw a picture yesterday of this particular place where we were. Monsieur. We were so in love, we were so cute, much cuter than we are today. So when you're single, you're you, much more fit. And then you become in love, you find a partner, and then you just start don't giving a shit about yeah. yourself. But Amelia, let's go for a walk, yeah. okay? Come on. Five hundred L, and L means extra long. <laughs> so that was the bigger, the bigger fiat back in nineteen something. No people living there. Only a tree. It's a tree house. You can see down there some of the oldest buildings here. It's actually quite sad that they are not being used. I mean, you could create some pretty insane homes right there, like in Matera. 
This is so Italian. I think it's more French, isn't it? The only thing you need is like a table right here and lady and the tram and a big bowl of spaghetti. Oh, the, actually, I have a fun fact, sort of a fun fact. You know how most not Italian people think that spaghetti meatball is like a national Italian dish, but really it was Disney who actually invented the spaghetti meatball dish because here in Italy you don't get spaghetti with meatballs. You do have meatballs and you do have spaghetti, but not together. That's for sale. How on earth would you move your furniture in here? There's no space at all. This is cute. It's like I'm saying this is charming, this is cute, this is nice, but really that's just a fact, okay? I think I've said it before, but there's this one thing that I just never will understand and it's how the old architecture of not just Italy but Southern Europe in general how the old architecture is so beautiful and charismatic and mwah, and then all the new buildings you see it's, it, it looks like garbage it's the same in Denmark everything they build in Denmark oh my god it just looks like a public school it should be priority for our European society to maintain beautiful architecture write that down I think it's it's not Barolato, it's Carolato. Oh, you're so cute. It's quite uh, an adventure to walk around here. I think it's time to go back to the car because we have another place we need to go. It's called Stilo. Continue. Oh, that was good. Yay! Oh. Now we're taking a, a detour through the mountains and this road is so not good. Look at this! They are so close! Oh my, oh god. my god, there are many! There are so freaking many! What the hell? <laughs> I don't know if this ever ends. There are hundreds! I, oh, it's just in front of the car! What? <laughs> and the owner comes, like the owner comes now. <laughs> I've oh, never they're helping each other, that's pretty cute. I've never seen this. One of the things I remember from last time we were here is that the roads, they are like A grade Top Gear material. They are so curvy and narrow and the nature is beautiful and and I'm so happy that we that we rented the Mini Cooper Countryman because it's like go karting. It's so fun. Welcome to Stilo. This town, this place, we are pretty sure is the reason why the Fiat Stilo is named Fiat Stilo. It's much more pretty than uh, the car though. Yeah. <laughs> so I don't know, like it should be like a Ferrari Stilo. We've been here before and um, although the men here, they look at women like they are really hungry. Like a wolf would look yeah. at a sheep. It's a really, really nice place. It's kind of similar to Barolato. I think it's older, maybe. History. But um, I just remember last time we were just, it was just so pleasing to walk through the streets. The goal is to find La Catolica di Stilo. And that is a very, very old church built in the 9th century. It's also one of the best preserved Byzantian churches, which we just read on Wikipedia. More path. exciting is probably the path to the church because now we're walking through what we love.
we are almost there, Amelia. Which is nice because we have been walking this steep. The good thing is we're walking downhill on our way back. <laughs> and you won't have pizza yesterday, so we need it. That's it. Six euros. Better be good. It must have had a refurbishment. No. But I mean, maybe in the 16th, 16th century. No, that's the whole point, Amelia. It's well maintained. That's why people pay to come here. So you're telling me that they put windows in the churches in the 9th century? Yeah. Really? I guess so. <sighs> wow. 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 Amazing to think that this is more than a thousand years old. That's like my grandmother times 10, although this is in better shape. <laughs> it looks really cool from this uh, angle. I can't believe it's, it's original. That's absolutely incredible. This was epic. Yeah. This is not as well maintained. It looks much older. Yeah, it doesn't even look But like then on the other hand, no, because if you look here, this is like Gladiator when he walks through the... We're lamming so much right now, Amelia. Yeah, we are, but that's because we're getting hungry. Oh my god. It's because we're getting hungry. Capsule I want to show something that is one of the biggest accomplishments by humankind. Are you ready? <laughs> you knew it was coming. You knew exactly what I was talking about. But um, that was a quick glance at Stilo. That's one of the things that I like the most about Calabria as a whole region. You find the most authentic little towns in the world, possibly. We travel a lot, but small towns like this, they are very unique in the matter that they look different. They look more authentic and nobody really speaks English. And it's just really nice that you feel you are with the locals. I actually think we have seen only two tourists. That's something I rate high in my book. Let's finish up and go to the villa. Cheers, mate. What are you cooking, Amelia? Caminata. Can it top this uh, morning's breakfast? Sure. Amelia, she dropped. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Amelia, but it was your portion, so stop. I want the amount of cheese as you thought was the amount of pepper I wanted. Thank you. What we did today is one of the things that you do when you're here at Calabria. It's all about vacationing, basically. We're working very hard, but we're portraying the people who go here to vacation. Because, to be honest, that's what it's all about here. And uh, we're gonna continue showcasing. <coughs> Bless you. How to vacation in Calabria. Yeah. So um, let's finish off with a beautiful um, sunset. Remember to subscribe, like and hit the bell button. Subscribe. And also remember not to put this much pepper in your carbonara. That's it guys. See you in the next vlog. Goodbye. Why did I say it was not used?